it's Easter Sunday and we're in Dubrovnik the water it's a little after six in the morning and we're just walking towards the old city I mean this is uh, just everything is made out of this beautiful bedrock and I can't I wonder how many millions of tons has been quarried from the mountains behind us there's an entire kind of mountain base that's missing oh wait, this gives me the eebie-jeebies a bit but look at those steps hewn into the rock down there and there's lots and lots of little passageways old walls this has been a fork city for probably its entire history because of the terrain and it's like that being that bond movie that just came out which was filmed in northern Italy. It looks like a lot of these places are on the same geological basis and needs must. See, there, even there, like everywhere is a battlement, kind of. Uh, I, this is probably the worst example here because we're about to go into the old city. Look, every building is insane. We're in a hotel just behind us, walking currently. Um, about, I was like about 50 meters above sea level, down to sea level. And I just can't get over how old everything is and how everything is almost a novel construction with a lot of similarities. But there's, I've not seen two homes that are really alike. And this old stone is absolutely bonkers. So the mountain where they quarry it out of is just coming into view over behind. And it's that entire range that runs just behind us. The road sweepers out. See everywhere. It's like some of them are old. Got those old bears. Some of them are new. Beautiful. So as you can see, like the bedrock starts there. So the terracing of houses continues back towards the mountains. On the other side of those mountains is Bosnia Herzegovina. I can't really pronounce that properly, but Bosnia is on the other side. And this part of Croatia is a thin, tiny strip that runs towards the very south of the country and across the sea. That way, you can't see it from here, across that way, is the Adriatic Sea and the middle part of Italy with Naples and Rome ish again just these beautiful like you can't really see but it goes all the way back into the hills there and all the way down on the right hand side and all the flags everywhere lots and lots and lots of flags around it's mostly outside the hotels that you'd expect but everything is clean from what I've heard so far, there's no crime here. It's just because this makes so much money for the Croatians, they keep it very, very safe for the tourists because it's a bit cheaper than Spain, but it's got a history of being a little bit poorer, right? Look at these houses. Oh my God. It's just insane. Oh, I want to live up there. But what's up there? See what I mean? Like, that's just the start. There'll be another passageway back again, back again, up, up, up. You have to be a bit careful down these roads because the buses, they, they, they're they unforgiving as they come past. So, <laughs> that one, like. So, it's a little bit further down here. It's quite a steep descent now, it's quite nice. I enjoy walking back up over breakfast. So it's um, daytime temperatures, not that far off what Spain was. Uh, Tenerife's going up towards 30 this weekend, then back into the mid 20s. Here during May, it's about 23 average high in a day, which means it'll go from like 19 up to high 20s. Uh, during the night, it's cold as balls. It's really cold. Came out this morning, it was about five o'clock, and it was. Freezing! Wow. I just you know, 
I say, well, it's the fun of walking down the street. But just, uh, I think it's, it's the breathtaking scenery just everywhere that's just going to be great. We're going to be here for eight weeks and then back to Narita, I think. Um, by which time we want to have launched one of our products. We've had a conversation this week about whether we want to launch one or two products at a time. So we're going to go with one to start off with. We've chosen uh, Raptor for rebates. Easiest to implement, easiest to get in, easiest business case to show, and it still saves about the same amount of money, if not more. So that's why we're choosing Raptor for rebates. And essentially what we do in our business case generator is we show that we will give at least a 2,000% return. It's really hard for people to turn down because it pays for itself in the first month because 2,000 divided by 12 is over 100%. And if you can show that, then, then you know, no business is going to say no, really. Because we're just giving the money back. Rebates that they're already entitled to that they're not claiming at the moment. So you can see that just this unending beauty, right? There's the mountains behind. Well, there's part of the range, right? Even that's been built up on these houses here, they're just, these ones, like some of them, they're not even living now and they're going into a bit of disrepair, but there's so many of these huge sandstone buildings. And, well, I don't know if it's sandstone. It's not, it's not marble. If we have a closer look, it's not marble, right? But it's not sandstone either. It's some sort of limestone or something, I don't know. So it's a sedimentary rock, whereas that stuff up there, some of it looks volcanic, some of it doesn't. That's insane up there. So all this terrace, and you can see it in the distance too. Uh, there's another beautiful hotel, look. And this isn't even the main drag either. Another one here. So this, I've not even been to Italy, as some of you will know, but it gives, it's got that feeling. It's, it feels a little bit like what Malta's like, which isn't that far away from here. And the, uh, yeah, these streets have been here a long time. They're just so, yeah, the, so, the stone has worn down from the footsteps. It is ancient, this place. Here we go. You're going to start seeing some really cool shit now in the background through here because I'm just entering the old city. You can see the city walls. God, this is breathtaking. I know it doesn't look as good on video, but just, I can't believe what I'm seeing already down here. Yeah, there's a turret. You can see the top of the battlements up there. From this massive historic castle. It's Easter Sunday and six o'clock in the morning, give or take. So I guess there's people getting ready for work already. It's good, isn't it? Oh, you know, it reminds me a little bit of Portsmouth in some way, some of the, some of the stuff, but it's just everywhere. It's fucking crazy. Okay, so this is the old, old town or old city. We're just going to now. Oh, it's Easter egg. Happy Easter. And I'll, I'll do another film later. That one up there. That's all part of the same whole big castle. Yeah, just come down to the coast and I'll make a video later when there's more people around and. Jeebus, that water, oh, look at that. Oh. Hello? Oh, friendly pigeons too. Oh, nice little dungeon over there. Oh, this is amazing. I hope you have an amazing Easter and a lovely Sunday. Lots of love from Croatia.